New developments tonight for high school graduations. After Governor Greg Abbott's big announcement to close schools for the rest of the year, high school seniors were wondering, am I still going to walk? Will I still have a graduation? And what does that look like? 12 News reporter Kelsey Johnson made some calls to a few districts today to see what plans are in the works. Every school district I spoke with said they are planning to hold some type of graduation ceremony. Now, as far as what they're going to look like and when they're going to happen, that's going to depend on guidelines from the CDC, the governor and TEA. As a high school senior, graduation is something many are excited about. But for 2020 seniors, this year's ceremonies have hit a roadblock. The team of doctors advising us have determined that it would be unsafe to allow students together in schools for the foreseeable future. It was news LCM senior Lucas Rideout wasn't ready to hear. My high school experience is kind of over like that. Lucas says he can handle the flexible learning and being away from his friends, but would still like to have a graduation ceremony. Anybody's high school career can be long and full of different trials that you have to face, and that ceremony symbolizes like the reward of going through all of that. I reached out to several school districts to see if they're making any plans. Vider ISD still plans to hold its graduation ceremony on May 29th, but this could change. Newton ISD posted about its plans on Facebook. The district plans to hold its graduation ceremony on June 26th. Schools such as Silsby haven't nailed down anything just yet. They're waiting to hear from their county leaders, the governor and TEA. We're not going to deny our seniors anything because they definitely deserve, you know, what's, what's right for them. Even though this is not the end of his high school career he had planned, Lucas is keeping a glass half full attitude. As long as we're able to support one another and lean on each other, I think everything is going to turn out all right. Again, none of these plans are set in stone. Later this month, the Commissioner of Education will announce some guidelines for school districts on graduation ceremonies. In Beaumont, Kelsey Johnson, 12 News.